What is up, everyone? Welcome back to another late night edition of the Center Beacon. This weekend we have Test Server 2.4.0. We have uh, the new batch of robots, light, medium, and heavy. We were supposed to have skins. Uh, we don't have them. New skins? Question mark. No, uh, currently not. They're not in. Uh, I've been playing for the last like hour. I don't know, hour and a half, two hours and change, or whatever it's been since it went up. There are no new skins. So if they add those later on in the weekend, uh, I will put up another video covering the skins because honestly, you know, I'm, I'm kind of shallow. So that's what I was most excited about. Uh, these new robots, they're growing on me a little bit. You know what I mean? Um, I'm going to play with them some here that you can see. And, you know, I'm liking some of the things, you know, I don't know, it takes, you know, it's, you know I'm kind of old and cantankerous and it takes me a little while to kind of get used to things. This little one, I'm not liking the little one, okay? So nobody's going to convince me that that thing's any good. But the other two aren't so bad. I still don't see me buying them, um, especially for, you know, who knows what they're going to charge for them. But uh, they're growing on me a little bit. Uh, I had a little bit of fun with them. Uh, you know, what fun can be had on test server where everyone runs a triple something fury and is annihilating me before I can even leave the spawn. But uh, those are the slings and arrows that I suffer to bring you these videos. Um, that's a joke. It doesn't really, you know, it's no skin off my nose to do this. But uh, it is kind of annoying when no one runs anything that they're supposed to be testing. Uh, I talk about this almost every test server. So if anybody can hear me, you know, Feel free to try out what we're trying out instead of running a hanger of uh, five Trident Furies. Um, they're awesome. I'll just save you the trouble. Just get one on live. So I'm trying to buy the bots that had skins. It was supposed to be like the Gepard, the Rhino, uh, the Boa, um, and the Lancelot. I think the Lancelot, they were going to do that custom skin that that player designed that was, uh, you know, pretty cool. Not necessarily my uh, my flavor of ice cream, but it was pretty cool. And uh, But none of them came through. And uh, when you go to the paint shop thing, they uh, there, there were no skin options. So I'm going to skip that for now. I am just going to uh, kit these guys out and load them up. And uh, you can see here, I'm going to go through the little, like, uh, blurbs. You know, just so you can see, if you're not on test server, you can kind of see what this is about. It's just their little, you know, they're kind of boilerplate, uh, you know. Uh, the theme, clearly, you know, uh, uh, old, old West Cowboys, you know, Jesse, Jesse James. Um, I thought maybe the other robot would be named Frank, but it's not. So uh, Frank's, uh, Frank's brother, uh, is, is, or I should say Jesse's brother Frank, is not in this. This is Doc, um, is the other one. They basically just kind of tell you they have a quick draw thing, yada yada. Here's some recommended equipment, you know. And they're they're kind of pushing a little bit the uh, hybrid aspect, you know, which, which you can do. And I'll show you some of that a little bit, even though I still think Synergy is the way to go. And this is Butch. Butch is the heavy robot. Dangerous Deadeye, stocked up on firepower. Uh, etc. So on and so forth. And uh, I'm going to get these guys out. Uh, I actually ran out of gold. I didn't even know you could do that. I know, like, it seemed like, I want to say years ago, it, it feels like years. It's it's many, many, many months. Months and months ago, it felt like you had very little gold on test server. So you had to be careful, like, what you got. And if you spent it all, you had to, like, start over or something. Um, hadn't had that issue. And then I ran out uh, on this thing. So some of these weapons that I'm running were kind of like, oh, what do I do? Um, anyways, going through the skins here. Now, last week, I think Android test server was broken. It was like last week or the week before. So now we've got skins for the medium and the heavy. So here's, here's the medium. I think they look pretty good. I saw some people say that they didn't really like these skins or these colors. You can see there, there's no additional skins. Um, I like them, especially this one. I think this guy's got a really cool, like, uh, like Cylon Battlestar Galactica type thing, you know, with the, uh, the head there. Uh, I, I, I thought this thing, this thing's pretty nice, uh, you know, buy it just to have it in my hangar and just kind of look at it, you know, um, that's not weird. Um, you know, plenty of people do that. So anyways, you can see I've magically loaded weapons through the, uh, miracle of editing 
And just going to go with some kind of like, you know, standard stuff um, that makes sense. The little guy, aphids, you know, let them go, switch it out, let them go. Uh, this guy, a little splash, a little plasma. And uh, let's see, the uh, the Zeus and the Trident, you know, I'm thinking, okay, you know, I'm a ranged, mid-range support robot. Uh, you know, he's got shields. I'll hit him with the Trident. Uh, he's got an energy shield. I'll hit him with the Zeus, yada, yada. Trebuchet just gonna go for max effect. I still, I, it's it's elusive, you know. It's like trying to see Bigfoot, but I want to kind of get like, can I get like two shots and then two more shots uh, on a target at you know like nine hundred thousand meters? This one here is the one I ran out of gold on, so I put some Tolumbuses on this thing. Um, surprisingly, it wasn't that bad, and you'll see that here uh, in the footage to come. So here we go. We're gonna start out with uh, Big Boy here. Butch. Um, you can see I put some details in there for you, so watch out for those throughout the video. Uh, just trying to help you guys out. So, like, I, nobody really watches all of any one video. You know, we all kind of just catch a couple of minutes, so that way you can get a few more details, and that way you know at least what is currently the plan on uh, test server, you know, and then one day for live. This is where we're at now. 45 second cooldown. Uh, that's an eternity. I, I really don't like this cooldown from everything I've, I've, I've seen on social media, from everyone I've talked to, uh, guys in my clan, you know, buddies that I have. Um, everybody hates these cooldowns. They're way too long. Now, the other ones do seem to be much shorter, and uh, I really appreciated that, and that is a nice change. And you're going to see that in clips uh, that we've got coming up. But this one, 45 seconds, ooh, it's so long. Um, I would, uh, if, if Pixonic can hear me, uh, in Russia, and it's really so, it, you know, it's really far away, so I don't know if they can, um, but hear me, and, uh, please, uh, make the cooldown on this thing, uh, perhaps, uh, commensurate with the, uh, cooldown on, say, like, the trebuchets, like, if you could get this thing in, like, the neighborhood of 25 seconds, 23 seconds, you know, like, with the trebuchet, it'd be really sweet, you know, you fire the trebuchet, flip in the new ones, and then fire again, you know what I mean? And then that way, like, while the other one is charging, you know, you see where I'm going with this? Um, 45 seconds, though, is, uh, is an eternity. So I found myself kind of staying with one weapon you know, uh, through the majority of my time playing this robot. But uh, I did like him more. Um, you know, they did, I believe they upped the hit points. And uh, I don't think he's any faster. Uh, but, you know, what are you going to do? But I did kind of like this particular combo. Um, although I felt like my Zeus's weren't hitting very hard. Like, I felt like I should have done more damage for, like, two maxed Zeus's on that target down there. I felt like eh, I should have eaten a little bit more of that bot, but I don't, I mean, who knows? You know, sometimes we get these little stealth things that we don't know what's going on on test server. Stuff doesn't work right. But I did enjoy this combo. Um, and, and it is kind of nice uh, to have the hybrid set up, you know, for those situations where applicable. You know, you're on a good team, you're hanging back, chilling over here. And you're afforded the luxury of kind of just going from cover to cover and picking targets and then selecting the, uh, you know, appropriate weapon to respond. Um, other than that, I like I like weapons with synergy, you know, same, same uh, for max effectiveness when I do get a shot. If you notice down there, if anybody knows how that guy got his fury up on that thing, do you see the, the triple Zeus fury down there? He's up on that platform. Now, I don't know. I, I assume you walk up another robot or something and you can get up there. But if you notice, this guy will be up here like this, almost this entire match. He got behind that thing and he can shoot like right over the top of that, but you can't get him. So not really sure what's going on. I've not seen that before. If anybody knows, uh, drop a comment and, uh, you know, share the, uh, the secret sauce there because I was kind of like, what, what is it? That's like the tallest fury I've ever seen. Or he walked up on that ledge somehow. So, I don't know. Maybe that guy, uh, you know, maybe he's got some hops. You know, special ability that I don't know about. But uh, I thought that was weird. So, anyways, we're going to try to finish these guys off. Uh, it was strange this weekend. Uh, I actually won all of my test server matches, which has never happened before. Um, like, months of doing this. And so, uh, as soon as I'm done recording this, I'm going to go buy a lottery ticket. Because I feel like my luck is finally changing. If I can win 
uh, all of the test server matches that I played. I mean, I, I feel like the sky's the limit, really. So, um, we're going to, let's see, where am I at in my program? Let's, let's check the schedule. We're going to watch this match for a little bit more. <laughs> we're going to do this for a few more minutes. I thought we were moving on, but we're not. So, uh, I kind of like, I, I did clip a lot of these videos, um, uh, because again, I don't want to waste your time and obviously don't want to waste my own time, but I kind of wanted to like leave, you know, some meat of the match in here so that if you guys do get a spare 10, 15, 20 minutes, you can kind of watch and see how the battle goes and get an idea of, okay, this is, this is what a match is going to look like. If I, if I, you know, if I go with, uh, you know, what Pixonic wants me to do here and I invest in one of these new bots with whatever resource it's going to cost, this is what it's going to look like when I play through, you know, five or six minutes on Shinzen or Canyon or whatever it ends up being and kind of what you can expect. So I think in this match, I pretty much stayed in this bot the entire time. And see, there's a, uh, I believe that guy's in a Lancelot, and I hit him with the Zeus, and then, you know, obviously, if I had the cooldown was ready, I'd want to be switching over to those Tridents, because if I'm, if I'm, you know, obviously dumping my energy uh, into the guy's shields, we're not doing a whole lot there. So, I want to switch to the Tridents, and you can see that 45 second cooldown recycle, it's a, it's a long time. And I, I feel like, I, I don't feel like anything is going to, like, be game-breaking if we, say, chop that thing down to, like, 20-something seconds. I, I just, I don't see how that's going to be a huge deal, especially with the preponderance of uh, triple, you know, Trident and Trebuchet and Zeus and, you know, uh, nuclear missile tipped whatever they can throw up there, um... You know, their Furies are predominant right now in uh, in gold at, at the highest levels. Uh, they're everywhere. And everybody's got, seems like everybody's got at least one or two. And every team ha is, you know, they're coming out of the gate with two or three of the things. And those things are firing every 10 seconds, every four seconds, you know. Uh, Trebuchet is obviously a little bit longer. Um... But I, I just, I, compared to that, I, I don't, you know, I don't know if I would buy this thing and replace my Fury, um, you know, with a 45 second cooldown to switch weapons. So that'd be my suggestion is continue to lower that cooldown. So moving on here, this is Jesse, Jesse James. I wanted to show you guys how awesome this guy is. Uh, 85,000 hit points and dead. So that's what happens when you, you know, don't test what's supposed to be tested and you run into uh, a team of Furies on the other side. But, you know, they're going to do what they're going to do. Uh, I'm going to do what I'm going to do. And uh, th that's about it. But uh, old Jesse didn't last very long. But don't worry, I have more clips of Jesse coming up. Now, where I think most people are probably going to... Uh, Put their resources you know want to put their money it, it are, is going to be in the medium and the heavy uh, i'm i'm liking the speed and the maneuverability on the medium uh you can see here the, this little hybrid concept i kind of bought this by accident but it's actually kind of handy you know uh you can you can range some guys you've got 500 meters two tolumbuses you know not exactly devastating but you know nothing to sneeze at either and then all of a sudden it's like oh hey mr rhino you flip out those organs and you know in a in a situation where i was otherwise ill-equipped to deal with that emerging threat you know now all of a sudden i can't and the cooldown on this guy is uh much more forgiving uh roughly 15 seconds uh, thereabouts the email they sent out was actually it listed uh times that were different by a couple of seconds but you know if you look at when i'm pressing the button uh, and the thing is actually happening. It, it's it's more like kind of what I'm saying here. So I don't know if they tweak that at the end, but we're gonna move on to uh, same battle. But uh, I was kind of excited to try this guy, and uh, this is old Butch again. And the uh, the four trebuchets is something that I've kind of been interested in 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 trying to experiment. And can I get two shots on a guy? Flip out the other set of trebuchets and land two more shots. Um, what I'm discovering, uh, so far is that it's much easier said than done. That's why I always advocate for, uh, you know, uh, weapons that, that are, are synergistic with one another, uh, because you can see how that guy got behind cover there. Uh, a lot of times you only get that one shot. That might be the last time you ever see that guy. 
Uh, thanks, uh, pronounced Mesa, for uh, saving my, my, my butt there. Uh, but, you know, just like the guy that shot at me, that might be the last time he ever gets a crack at this guy. You know, you, you get that one opportunity to land as much damage as possible, and that's why I just, I kind of prefer that, you know, if, if I'm, if I'm going to get to take a shot at you, I want to deliver everything I can right then and there. So... You know, but uh, the it is, you know, theoretically possible you could get that guy caught in the open, you hit him with this thing, you flip out the next set, you hit him again and finish him. I don't know. Um, you know, that that would be the idea between, uh, between I'm not sure what I'm between, rock and hard place here right now, but uh, behind this, uh, this type of setup. You know, you, you pop him out, you hit that guy again. Uh, strangely, he didn't die. I'm not sure uh, what was going on there. But he lived for a time. And uh, so I, I kind of liked this, you know. And, and yes, my trebuchet uh, skills, uh, spelled with a Z, are awful. Um, you can see here, I'm totally going to miss this guy. I'm waiting for him to drop his shield. I want him to drop his shield because I know that the Rhino shield is just going to absorb my energy. So I want him to drop his shield. And I'm trying to line up the shot and I totally miss. It's just sad right there. It's just sadness. Um, look away for a moment and then turn back and then watch the rest of the video. But uh, the the sensitivity, I'll blame it on that. It's different on test server. It's still, it's I don't know what's going on between live and, and, and test server, but there's a difference. Uh, but... I never use these things. I have a bunch of them. I've got like three of them on live. But uh, it was one of those things that, you know, you buy it right away when you first start playing. And you're like, I'm going to rule with these. And then you realize that they take uh, freaking forever to reload. And you end up going elsewhere for your damage needs. But I do have uh, three of them. And I do have plans of, of dusting them off at some point. So, so there you can see, you know, I eat the Triple Fury uh, trebuchet there. It didn't feel good. Um, that doesn't feel good too. That like little, like that poof, you know, that's, it's, it's almost like more of an, you know, it's, it's adding insult to injury, but, uh, yeah, so I'm going to dust these things off at some point, but I've not played with these in like a year if it's, uh, if it's been that long. So, uh, you know, just, just kind of showing you guys, like, you know, we're using cover. We're in a little bit of a duel over here. You know, I'm trying to get, trying to get a shot on that guy, but the other team has, you, know, you can see what I'm eating right there. The other team has like two or three furies rocking like right now. Um, and then there's, there's red laser guy. Um, red laser guy, I believe was running the, the Jesse, uh, you know, new robot. And I'm pretty sure he had geckos stacked with geckos. Uh, I'm, I don't know. Maybe you guys should watch his videos. But uh, I'm not sure if that's going to be the way that I'm going to go with it. But, uh, you know, I don't know. To each his own. So, uh, here, here's back to this combo. Liking this. The Zeus and the, uh, the trebuchet. I kind of backed up into this little spot here. Sometimes, uh, I don't know if you guys ever notice when you play. Like, you just don't see a guy sometimes. And uh, you can see it's kind of shadowed. You're kind of in the crook of this little, uh, it's like a mesa with some, like, I don't know, some debris next to it or something. And uh, there's a lot going on, but nobody really pays much attention to me while I'm sitting here. So uh, just take those things into account that sometimes uh, you can kind of, like, disappear into the background, especially, you know, if you're at 600 meters or, or, or more. So here I come out of the shadows uh, to try to put some hate on this guy. Uh... You know, another non-conformist here with his triple trebuchet fury that uh, everyone knows is, is going to work just fine. But uh, he decided to roll it out on test anyways. Um, so so this combo, you know, this this worked out okay. This red laser guy is uh, he's shooting me in the hip. I don't really care right now. I kind of want to get that guy. Um, you know, and then I'm kind of like, all right, all right, red laser guy. Let's, uh, let's see what we can do about you because this is just, I mean... You know, it's kind of insulting. Uh, you know, I don't know what he thinks. Like, he's, you know, we're going to have... The game only lasts 10 minutes. I mean, uh, you can see here, you know, there's four minutes already gone. Uh, or I should say uh, six minutes already gone. And, I mean, it's going to take him at least another six minutes to melt me with that thing. So, I'm not going to pay too much attention to him. You know, but at the same time, I have to defend my honor as a man. So, uh, you know, I, 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 think I, I think I put him in his place. I think he, uh, 
You know, I think he's learned his lesson. No, he's still out there. No, he's still over there. He's on the bridge. Uh, take note of that vantage point just for, like, if you guys are ever on uh, Canyon, you can actually, you right where that guy was, you can get under your bridge and to the guy on the bridge. So just kind of like, you know, put that away in your, uh, your, your war robot, uh, you know, data file. And uh, it doesn't look like you can hit it. It looks like maybe you'll hit your bridge, but you can actually get under that thing. So... Uh, I think we took care of uh, Red Laser Guy at least. This guy, I don't think we uh, quite get to. Um, at least not with the uh, the Zeus's. But, uh, surprisingly, another win uh, for the center beacon here. Um, at least it'll be a win uh, in the future, in a few minutes here. Not to spoil it, but uh, yeah, I, I win this one. So, uh, here we are back on the uh, dock bot, the medium. And I'm thinking I'm going to use my superior speed, you know, to run this guy down. I damaged him a little bit. I think it's the uh, heavy, heavy, the new heavy robot there. Damaged him a little bit with the Tulumbuses. But every time you kind of go to this flank and the enemy spawn is over there, it doesn't work out. You know, I got annihilated. Um, unfortunately, I really kind of wanted to run him down. But uh, you could see, you know, theoretically you could do it. We're back on Jesse now. I promised more Jesse. And here he is. Uh, you know, he's a novel little sucker. And uh, I, I really don't see this one doing anything for me. I don't know why I wouldn't just have a Gepard or a Patton here. Um, and instead of a special ability, I basically have a special penalization. Uh, you know, i got to wait to use my other two aphids. So they've not sold me on that one. The medium and the heavy, I, I, I can see, you know, eh, we're getting there. You know, maybe a little bit more work to do. And, uh, and, and maybe I buy those guys if, if just, you know, to break up the monotony or something. But uh, the the light one, I don't think so. Uh, we're not there yet. We got we got a lot more work to do. Um, they're gonna have to probably like you know do a special skin with my name plastered across the thing, or or you know the center beacon edition light Jesse robot or something to get me to run that guy because I just I'm not seeing it. This guy I like though. Look how look how tough he looks. I really like that uh, the the skin that they put on this thing. Uh, pretty cool, liking that. And the coolest thing about the big ones here is that those guns, like, they're right in your face, you know, they stick out, which is pretty awesome. So, uh, so that's gonna do it for this one. I wanted to give you guys a down and dirty on the, the, you know, where they're at with the, uh, new robots. Uh, again, as for the skins, they were promised, uh, not delivered. Um, maybe they'll kind of patch that in, you know, as, as the weekend goes on, or maybe they're just gonna decide, you know, hey, we couldn't get it in, we're gonna roll without it. So, uh, if they do put it in though, uh, check back with me because I will get a video up on that as soon as possible because I was pretty excited about the skins. Um, but that's it for this one and I hope you enjoyed it. And as always, uh, thank you for liking, subscribing, uh, taking the time to watch my videos. I really appreciate it. And I will see you next time at the center beacon.